Okay. What's going on? Um, zombie was just chasing me, attacking me. I don't know what. But um, someone needs to explain to me what's going on. For real. I mean, I never expected to use that gun. But I. Okay, I don't even know what's happening right now. <sighs> People are taking this game way too seriously. It's like Zombie Land. It's like Zombie Land out there. I mean, you guys haven't seen it. I mean, you guys don't know about the double tap, double tap rule. It's like one of the most important rules when it comes to zombies ever. I think you've really never heard of Zombie Land. Uh, Woody Harrelson, Jesse Eisenberg, uh, Emma Stone, and that chick that I can not even tell how old she was. <laughs> um, it's, it's a hilarious movie. And it has a lot of action and actually a lot of really gory scenes. And sorry, I'm just checking to make sure no more zombies follow me around. So it might be even too too light up in this room. But I'll have to risk it. It's Tuesday. Like three in the morning, but it's Tuesday. So I gotta talk about a Blu-ray and even if the zombie apocalypse is going on outside, I'ma talk. I'm gonna do this review. So Zombie Land came out in 2009. Um, like I said, it stars Jesse Eisenberg. Uh, Woody Harrelson, Emma Stone, and to be honest, I need to look at this. And Abigail Breslin. Don't remember what else she's been in. Emma Watson, gorgeous actress. Um, she's been in a bunch of stuff and played a really great version of Gwen Stacy for the most part. Uh, I don't believe it was her fault for what happened in the second one, but anyway. So the movie starts off letting you know with the credits, with the intro credits, that stuff is going to hit the fan and it's going to hit it really quick and really hard um, or as they put it, it's going to hit the windshield or stuff is going to get hit, stuff like that. Um, get introduced to Jesse Eisenberg's character um, and then Woody Harrelson and it becomes kind of a buddy cop kind of thing, kind of, but in a zombie land, uh, no pun intended honestly. Um, they just kind of learn to survive together, but first, uh, Jesse Eisenberg is kind of figuring out how to survive, and uh, he made up all these rules as to how to survive, and uh, double tap is one of them, double tap meaning uh, shoot the zombie twice, don't be stingy with your bullets, make sure the zombie's dead, because if not, um, if you don't make sure that it's dead, it can get you, and so... I follow that rule. I make sure I don't get bitten. Um, I mean, normally I just use my bow and arrow, but seeing as I didn't have my bow or arrows in the car, yeah. Anyway, soon he meets Woody Harrelson's character. Um, they kind of team up, and hilarity ensues. Um, I really don't want to spoil it because a lot of the really cool stuff is um, them fighting the zombies and um, there's this really cool part where they're with the girls and they're just kind of destroying this whole store to get everything out of their system because hey life got tougher during the zombie apocalypse they lost the people they loved and um, they just kind of have to come to terms with it and like most movies there's usually some sort of romantic uh, relationship kind of building and so this one is between Jesse Eisenberg and Emma Stone's character and as unlikely as it may seem in our real world or in the real world however you want to put it it actually kind of works in the movie um, besides them being pretty much the last people you see in the movie and there's no one else alive except there is but yeah you guys have to see the movie for that but 
Man, was he busting ghosts back in the day. I do want to share with you guys a couple of things before I go. First of all, I don't know if you guys could see me in the back or not, but got another dancing baby Groot, whatever you want to call him. But he's the Hot Topic exclusive one. Yes, he still bobbles. He's actually a bit darker, and as you can see, the pot says, I am Groot. So, as of right now, I have every version of Groot, but there's another one coming out where it's like the Loot Crate exclusive one, both at the glow and the dark hand. Don't know why they're doing that, but whatever. So the whole reason the video is kind of zombie theme is because of the game that I don't have with me at the moment, but Dying Light comes out today. Um, if you guys haven't heard of it, it's kind of like a zombie parkour game where in the day you scavenge and uh, take down zombies, but you make like a little crew, a little group uh, that's trying to survive and at night um, stuff hits the roof uh, for lack of a better term, which I cannot use right now. Um, yeah, so stuff hits the roof and the zombies actually hunt you. They're pretty smart and um, some players can actually control like one of the big zombies that hunts at night and that's pretty cool um, so I will be doing a review about it probably my next video will be kind of a review with some friends about it uh, hopefully some friends that have played it already because I'm not too sure how many of my friends are getting it this soon but uh, yeah expect that one to also have a zombie skit hopefully in the daylight and if you guys are liking the skits at the beginning, let me know uh, by giving me a thumbs up, uh, leaving a comment down below in the comment section, and until next time guys, have a good evening, good morning, good night, whenever you get to see this video, thanks for watching, bye.